Hey boys and girls, I'm the reading teacher. I went to our school's book fair today and I found a book that had me laughing out loud. And I thought, I can't wait to share this with my friends on our YouTube channel. So I bought it and I'm gonna share it with you. At the end of this book, you're gonna know what the word impatient means. Maybe you already know what impatient means already. But if you don't, by the end of the story, you're gonna learn what impatient means. Boys and girls, this story is written by Ross Burak, and it's called The Very Impatient Caterpillar. Is it time yet? You might already know some things about caterpillars. Do you know, for instance, how they start their life? As an egg, yes. And out of the egg crawls a little caterpillar. The caterpillars eat lots and lots of leaves. And then do you know what they do? They climb up on a branch and they transform or turn into a chrysalis. And inside that chrysalis, their body is actually changing. And they come out not as a caterpillar, but as a... So this story tells a little bit about their life cycle, but we get to meet this cute little character and he is very impatient. Hey, what are you guys doing? We're going to metamorphosize. Meta what now? Transform into butterflies. Right, right, I knew that. Wait, you're telling me I can become a butterfly? Yes. With wings? Yes. For real? Yes. Wait for me. Now what? Build your chrysalis. Chrysalis. Right, right. I knew that. What? How did you do that? Is it a spin or more of a twirl? Am I a butterfly yet? Ugh. Now what? Just be patient and let nature take its course. Patience, right, right, I got this. Am I a butterfly yet? No. How about now? No. Now? No. Be patient. I have a question. Not yet. You don't even know what I was going to ask. Fine. Ask, how's your day going? Also, am I a butterfly yet? No, just be patient. Shh, we're trying to metamorphosize. Okay, okay. Obviously, I know this, but do you know how long this takes? Two weeks. Right, right, two weeks. Two weeks? Oh, what am I going to do in here for two weeks? Can I get a comic book or something? Hmm, what if I want a snack? Hello, two pizzas please. My address, a chrysalis. Click, hello, hello. How long have I been in here? What if I need to use the bathroom? Anyone want to play a game? It's still day one. This is taking forever. That's it. I feel metamorphosized enough. Do you think he's ready yet? Hasn't been two weeks. Look out world. Feast your eyes on this beautiful butterfly. How do I look? Transformed, time to spread my wings and fly. Wait, where are my wings? Splat, time for a new approach. Okay, you can do this. You can be patient. Oh, uh, who am I kidding? I can't be patient. You are the little caterpillar that could. 
I'm the little caterpillar that couldn't. Get a grip. You can. I can't. I can't. You can. I can't. You can. I can't. You can. I can't. Can. Can't. <laughs> I love the facial expression on that squirrel. I can be patient. Patience is all in the mind. Be one with the chrysalis. <laughs> breathe in, breathe out. Look, day six, I'm doing it. Just be patient, just be patient, just be patient. Two weeks later, is he gonna come out a caterpillar? I did it! I'm a butterfly! Now, would you be sad if the author ended the story right here? I would be. We've really gotten to know this character, this butterfly or caterpillar character, and we know something about him, that he is very, what was that word again? impatient. So we know it's not going to quite end here, is it? You know, I do feel transformed. Starting now, I'm going to be way more patient. That's great. Hey, where are you all going? We're migrating. Migrating, right, right. Wait for me. Ugh. <laughs> so he's still being impatient, isn't he? But that's what we love about this character. Do you know what I noticed on the very last page at the very bottom? It makes me so happy. Ross Barak dedicated this book to his mom. I love that. Do you know, why would he dedicate this book to his mom? Think about if you connected to this caterpillar in any way. Have you ever been impatient before? Maybe that's why he dedicated it to his mom, to say, I'm sorry for all the times that I was so impatient as a child. So then what does impatient mean? If you are thinking that it means that you just can't wait for something, then you are right. Great job. All right, I hope I will see you guys soon.